a pepperoni pizza. Is it good? It's spoiled. Perfect. Just how we like it. Hello, everyone. Welcome back. <laughs> um, welcome back to our next episode. Uh, we're miserable as per usual. That's okay. We're used to it at this point. So anyway, let me just while we fix his. Oh my god, you're so needy. While we are fixing his needs, I will just attempt to order a pizza again because we're very hungry. I'm just gonna explain what's happening. Also, let me just say this again. I am so, so, so sorry and also upset about the last episode. I don't, I don't understand what happened. I don't know what went wrong. I was so excited to finish that um, aspiration that we had and show it to you guys and you didn't even get to see it because the video was just non-existent. I'm really, I'm really sorry. I don't know why that happened. That has never happened to me before. But anyway, um, so we are in our next episode now. Can we call the sadness hotline? Why is that not a option? Who are you going to go and chat with? Oh, oh, thank you. You actually brought me a pizza for a change. So you can go away now because we need to eat. So basically, um, we finished the aspiration, the curator one. So um, we have this new aspiration that is like all about fishing. I'm not that excited about it because I just feel like it's going to be really boring. Um, but like we are already doing it and we I want to focus on the nature aspirations for for now. And so we might as well just do it. So... The thing was, I was going to, in this episode, I was going to move and I was going to go into a world that had, um, you know, seasons. So that would give us a bit more diversity, like gameplay wise. And it would just, I miss not having seasons. I think seasons are one of the most important elements in the game. And that was my plan. And then, so while we went to you know a random world we would like start building and then you know work on our fishing skill while doing that and so i was gonna do that and then i went into my skills and then i realized that our fishing skill is already at level eight i don't know when that happened <laughs> i mean obviously we've been you know exploring and digging and all that so i guess it just happened sometime. I don't know. But now I feel moving to a world and building a house there just to get a skill up for two levels is a bit silly. So what I'm thinking, and well, you can't really respond, so I'll do it and then hopefully um, you think it's a good idea. What I'll do is I will actually, I will move, but I will skip the moving to a world with seasons part because what I was going to do after I was going to move there live there for a while and then be like oh you know what we've realized that we don't really like that that's just not our lifestyle we want to go back to where we came from you know go like roughing it up essentially and then we would go and move to Sulani that was my goal but now like I said that seems a bit, you know, we have to make some adjustments. So what I'll do is I'll just move to Sulani straight away, which, yes, will not have seasons, but at least it's a different world. And then while we're in there, we will be working on our fishing skill, you know, doing some other things. And then um, I also want to do the whole, you know, cleaning up the island thing. I want to do that. And... Um, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah. So I really am excited to do the whole off-grid because I have never done it before. I haven't played uh, Sulani that much, to be honest. And when I had, I never did the off-grid thing. But I feel for us, that makes sense. So I'm going to go and I'm going to do that. And we'll see how we go. And you know what? 
we'll make it work. We will make it to a world with seasons and all that that we were planning to. This is just a little bit of a a little bit of a road trip. Another one, you know, like the stranger was. <laughs> but you know, it keeps us on our toes. So uh, we're just gonna rest up, and then once we're up, we'll just pack. Okay. Excuse me. Um, I just almost <clears throat> choked myself to death by swallowing air. Um, so um, I will move, but I've decided I'm not gonna take anything with me because, like, you could go with. Oh yeah, like he tore it down. It's like it's just a shed, but I don't really want to do that. I feel like we're doing really well money wise. And I want to make it as hard as possible on us. And I don't think we have 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 had it that rough, to be completely honest. So I'm going to leave all his stuff. I will take his tent. I, I'm going to build a house. But I'm going to take the tent because I feel like, you know, you can fold it, put it in a bag, and just take it with you. But yeah, let's pack up and let's go so where do we want to move not this because that's the posh part this is like i don't want to be demolishing people's houses but there's literally just two options and i feel like it would have to be this or that this would be more um convenient i suppose but i really love I feel like if you live off the grid, it has to be on this one. So I don't want to be like bulldozing stuff, but let's just say that it happened before we came. <laughs> this is our new home. Um, like I wouldn't mind this, but like living on an actual island and then you have to swim to it every single time. That's just annoying. But first and foremost, let's fix our bot traits. And then off the grid, the third one. So I was, I was thinking of like either doing the team neighborhood again, or I feel like even the quake zone, even though it's very annoying, would be kind of, would make sense. But I'm thinking like, I don't want to do it, but I feel like, where is it? I feel like it would make sense. Is this one. I'll try it. If it gets, like, super annoying, we'll just change it. Okay, so. We have some money. Do we want to build ourselves a little shack? I think we have to have a deck. That would just make sense, right? If you're on an island, you want to have a deck. And then obviously we need a, an actual house as well. So maybe let's just go... Okay. Let's go... Uh, we don't want to go too overboard. Maybe just like so. I mean, the shape's not exciting, granted. But... Mm, you know. We'll, we'll work on it. Okay, so 
This is not ideal because it's night time. Um, but let's have a little house tour. I didn't know what to build, so it's just a simple box. It's very island living inspired, but I mean, at least we have an actual house. Um, so the thing is, I was gonna go furnish it, and then I realized that. Yes, there's a toilet that works off the grid. And yes, there's a shower that works off the grid. And there's a sink. But they're all very low quality and they make you uncomfortable. Can you call someone while I'm talking? Because you just really like your socials. He's cute. Let's call him. So they're just a very bad quality. And I feel like I was going to get a bed. But I'm like, the tent actually works really well. So we're going to actually keep the tent. I feel like it's important that we have like some sort of structure because it, there's going to be a lot of raining and a lot of volcanic activity. So it's important that we have somewhere to go and hide. I put in a bush for us to pee because the toilet and the bush are literally the same. And I'm like, if we're going to be off the grid, then we might as well just keep the bush. As well as, um, like I put in the shower, but I feel like showering in the waterfall is better because the shower is really crappy. But, you know, I didn't want to build a house. How are you already done with your conversation? You're still miserable. I think the guy really does not like us. Um, I was like, I'm just going to put it in because I don't want to have an empty house. So I just plopped a couple of counters and a sink. Um, we have some lights, which is good. And you can't use any of the stoves, obviously. So this is the only way of cooking. So it's, it's this. So let's just cook. Um, and it's good, though, because, like, we're going to have to pay for it. But at least we have fish that can uh, we can supply. Because we have a lot of stuff in our inventory. Uh, this is going to take a while. So... What can I do for you that will be... Oh, that's very handy. That would be fun. So our fish... I'm just going to call it a fish aspiration because that's literally what it is. So we need to fish at three different locations. So we've done one, apparently. Okay, cool. So can... We can't just... Oh, there's a bin. I didn't even have to buy one. Oh, well. Um. Oh, we need to clean this up. How do you, do you just walk around and clean stuff? Is that going to be fun as well? Let's see. Where did you grab, where did you get a glass from? You don't have a fridge. Okay, that's awfully uncomfortable. So, well, um, attract frogs, I guess. We're that person that's all about the fish and the frogs, I guess. Did that work? I can see frogs. Oh, they're everywhere. Uh, what? Okay. Um, I feel that was probably delayed from the pile that we cleaned. A pepperoni pizza. Is it good? It's spoiled. Perfect. Just how we like it. Um, so we need to get your fun up. Clean that up. I also... Should we get him a job? Oh, what a full frolic. Playing around in a natural wonder gives Sean a unique sense of joy. I imagine it would. Um, why would you want to argue with someone? Like, look, I know that you are hungry. I completely, um, I hear you. It will take a little while for that food to be, um, to be made. Yes, there is a fishing spot. Cool. Run, run, batch. 
At least he is, he is actually running. I appreciate that. Oh, I'm such an idiot. I'm such an idiot. He was going to argue with her because she's like the anti-environmentalist. Oh, this is going to be a fun, fun time for me and my, you know, my speaking abilities, which are just great. That's why he was going to argue with her. Dangerous debris. Well, you know, someone's got to do it. And I guess that someone is us. Oh, damn it. Oh, food is ready. Run, batch. Well, that's nice that you brought it in. How about you actually eat it? Excuse you! Hello? You can't just walk into a person's house like that. Who? Like, what gives you the right? No. Absolutely not. A hundred percent no. Mean, uh, go away. Like, yesterday. I don't care if we need socials. That's unacceptable. You will not be walking into our house like that. You didn't even tell him to go away. He just left on his own. You better not come back, you. Take two. Bish, bish. <laughs> oh, I swear to God. Um, okay, so fish with bait. Is this going to count as a second? Oh, it did. We just need one more. You're not going to school. We are at school. We are at school of life. <laughs> Clean that up. Clean that up. Clean an invasive species that damages the local ecosystem. Removing invasive species from local water makes a difference. Keep it up. I will. You can stop doing that now. So, um, I just wanna find just one more fishing spot. I don't think there is one around. So let's uh, go and pee. Clean that up. Clean this up. Is there only one fishing spot on this whole island? And then we can clean, clean these up as well. We are so active. Like we are digging. We are cleaning up. We are just running around. We're just... We are such a trooper. Like, we're just killing it at life. Look at us go. I mean, and like, he's still just a teenager. Um, slime from swimming near trash. Well, you know, we're working on it. We're getting rid of the trash so that other people don't get slimed. Um, I want to get him a tan though, like he's, he's living on the beach now, he needs to get a tan. Why are you sad? You're doing amazing, sweetie. I'm sorry, I had to. Um, so you cancelled all of those, well, guess what, tough. Um, you're gonna still do them all. I don't care if you're uncomfortable. I don't care if you're miserable. I really don't care about your excuses because we are on a mission and we are not getting distracted by stuff like Ew, low energy level. Tough. Tough it up. Tough it up? I don't know. Whichever one it is. Um, cool. Yay, we did it! What's the next one? Fish for 10 hours. Okay. Uh, mount or bowl? Well, I don't want to mount fish. Maybe try uh, put them in a bowl. To mount a fish, click on the fish and select mount. Alternatively, I was reading that. Alternatively, um, Sims can purchase a fish bowl from build mode under the study room sword. Simply click add fish to put a caught fish into the fish bowl. Okay, well that's pretty sim simple. We can totally do that. We can also stop fishing because uh, you are very, uh, very miserable. I'm starting to kind of feel bad. 
So just go here, clean this up for a change. So I just cleaned out his inventory so we have a bit of money. I was gonna sell this, but it's actually really expensive. So I'm not sure if I really wanna do that. So I'm gonna keep that on me for now. Um, so yeah, that's all the stuff. Cool. So um, we are pretty miserable. Let's just have a shower here, see how bad it feels. Oh, that was actually quite good. Oh, that's surprising. Uh, I mean, you're miserable. I don't blame you. It is 4.30 p.m. We have finally gotten out of bed or tent in our case. Cool. That's done. Stop whining. Let's go. Travel time. I have skipped forward a little bit because, oh, that's gonna, that's gonna be fun for us. Because I was, um, I went to the bar over there and I was, um, building his socials up because it was just terrible and it just, it took forever. And then it was alien night. So now there's aliens everywhere. Um, but yeah, so who are you? I'm not even going to try and pronounce that. Anyway, so my plan was to get him a job, but he is a teenager. I completely forgot about that. So he can only get like a couple of really lame jobs. You are quite handsome, sir. Um... So that was very fun. That's good. We, I'm determined to get him a tan. So I'm just waiting for the sun to come out. So let's let's talk to him. Why not? Um, so I really want him to get the environment, environmentalist. I think that's what it is. Career. Because I feel like that's something that he would do. And we plan to like clean the island anyway. So it just makes sense. So... Oh, can you go, s oh, ask to be pushed. No, let's ask to push. Yeah, we'll push you. Off to sleep. <laughs> so, uh, we're going to clean the island anyway. So I feel like it just makes sense for us to do that. And, you know, maybe earning some honest money would be good as well. So I'm going to do that. But that means it is time to grow up. That makes me very sad. I don't know if we're ready for that. Let's just get a 10. In nude. In front of a child. I'm pretty sure that that child is us. Oh my god, just stop whining with the school. That is enough. Oh, we got a 10. Yay! Awesome. Look at him. He looks so good. Um, Yeah, sure. You can grill a chicken if you want. So... I will, I'm going to leave this part here now, because I have no idea how long I've been recording, but like a lot has happened. We've moved, we cleaned the island a little bit, we got a house, um, all the good things. And then next, next time, I guess we'll be growing up. That's actually terrifying. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you liked this episode. A lot has happened. I'm really excited to be out of Oasis Springs. I was getting really tired of it. Um, and I'm so excited about this new chapter, the new era, if you will. I hope you like our <laughs> super boxy house. But, you know, baby steps. Okay, I'll see you guys uh, soon. I hope you're having a good day. And any suggestions, comments, anything, any feedback at all, leave it down in the comments below. Also, as I'm just uh, looking at this house, I just realized just now that, uh, what am I doing? That I did not change the trim on the roof. If you haven't already, I would appreciate if you do subscribe. Um, and yeah, I will see you next time. <sighs> we'll be blowing out the birthday candles, I guess. Bye.